Hi everyone! If you are new to my channel, I'm Tony Zavasta. I'm 55 years old and I want to look 30. And oh boy, it's getting hard. Therefore, I'm constantly looking for ways to keep aging at bay. I would like to share with you my newly discovered beauty secret. It is called the Body Sculpting Cup Method. It will visibly rejuvenate your skin. These are the sculpting cups that I'm going to use. You can apply these body sculpting cups on areas affected by cellulite, on your stretch marks, on your scar, revitalize aging skin, or to address the flap in your arms. Don't we all want that? I will demonstrate the cupping massage on my upper chest area. This area needs our at most attention. Why? Because it tells our age like nothing else. You will want to choose the appropriate size cup to fit the skin surface. On the chest area, I suggest you use the smallest cup. Here is how. First, apply some light oil. I usually use olive oil. Then wash your hands. There should be no oil residue left on your hands, so you will have a good grip on the cup. Place the cup at the area to be treated and squeeze the rubber ball. Slowly release the ball, allowing it to inflate. Once the cup is firmly fixed on your skin, pull it along, just like this, back and forth, from side to side, and you will feel a deep tissue massaging sensation. The oil makes moving your body sculpting cup easier and it acts as an air sealant. Okay, I am done with this area. That's all it takes. As you can see, the skin gets red. This is good. It's an indication that fresh blood is rushing to the surface. Don't worry, the redness should go away in a few minutes. Now, listen carefully to what I'm about to say. This is important. Just like with all holistic practices, whether juice or water fasting, the raw food diet or yoga, by the way, all of them I highly recommend. But with all these practices, you might feel worse before you start to feel better. The same situation applies to body sculpting. If your capillaries are in a really sorry state, you will feel some discomfort in that area, most likely some temporary bruises will appear. That's why I suggest you start with the less visible area of the body, such as the upper thigh or your butt, and begin with the smallest cup. The first five, six times I used these cups, I also felt some discomfort and had a few bruises. But a week after regular practice, no matter what cup I used, there was only a pleasant sensation and absolutely no bruising. And as your skin adjusts and regains its resilience, the redness will begin to disappear within seconds. Now, you've been warned. And if you don't want to deal with these initial reactions, don't even try the cupping massage. But if you stick with the practice and perform it daily, you will see your skin becoming tight, smooth and supple. I love cupping massage, and I never miss a day doing it and it makes my skin look younger. For more information about cupping massage and other advanced anti-aging practices, visit my website. This is Tony Zavasta. Thank you for watching.